Good morning dear students today we will learn the addition of capacity units let's start my dear students here you can see three types of measuring beakers whose capacity is written on it these beakers are used to measure liquid as you can see on the first beaker its capacity is written up to 200 ml means we can measure liquid up to 200 ml in this beaker in the same way on the second beaker its capacity is written up to 300 ml means we can measure any kind of liquid up to 300 ml in this beaker and in the third beaker its capacity is written up to 400 ml means we can measure a liquid up to 400 ml in this beaker dear students parneet's mother used 200 ml of milk to make tea and she used 300 ml of milk to make coffee and here we have to find the total amount of milk used by her to make tea as well as coffee so to find the total amount of milk used by her we will pour these two quantities of milk in a big container then we will see how much milk was used by her first of all pour 200 ml of milk in a big container now pour 300 ml of milk in this container my dear students here we can see that the total quantity of milk used by her is 500 ml now we will see that how we can solve this sum in written form quantity of milk used for making coffee was 300 ml and the quantity of milk used for making tea was 200 ml dear students like units are always added and we will when we will add these two quantities we will get total quantity of milk used as 500 ml dear students yesterday i bought two packets of milk from the milkman let's see what quantity of milk did i buy yesterday the quantity of milk in first packet was 1 liter and the quantity of milk in the second packet was 500 ml let's combine these two milk packets together and see how much milk did i buy yesterday so first of all i'll pour first packet of milk in the big container yes it is 1 liter 1 liter my dear student it is equal to 1000 ml now i will pour another packet of milk in this container then we will see yes now you can see the milk in this container is 1 liter 500 ml my dear students means yesterday i bought 1 liter 500 milliliter this quantity we can write as 1500 milliliter 1 liter 500 milliliter and also as 1.500 liter now we will see that how we can solve this sum in written form my dear students like units are always added as the quantity of milk in the first packet was 1 liter so we will write 1 under the column of liter and 0 0 under the column of milliliter and the quantity of milk in the second packet was 500 milliliter so we will write 0 under the column of liter and 500 under the column of milliliter now when we will add these like units together then we will see that how much milk did i buy yesterday and it was 1 liter 
and 500 milliliter. Dear students, now we will solve a question related with pass. And our first question is, there is 8 liter 750 milliliter water in a bottle and 15 liter 916 milliliter water in a bucket. What is the total amount of water in both? And for the answer of this question, we have four options. Our option A is 23 liter 750 milliliter. Option B is 24 liter 666 milliliter. Option C is 24 liter 916 milliliter. And option D is 23 liter 666 milliliter. My dear students, to find the total amount of water in both, we have to add the amount of water in bottle to the amount of water in bucket. The addition of these quantities we can do in our rough notebook also. And when we will add, we will get total amount of water as 24 liter 666 milliliter which is B option. So, we will tick this option. Now, it is time for homework. My dear students, from home you will solve question number first and third of exercise 5.9 in your notebook. Thank you.